Hey everyone, how's it going? It's that nerd Ryan here with the video review of the Marvel Legends Disney Plus Wave Falcon and the Winter Soldier Baron Zemo. So let's do a quick look of the box here. We got some Zemo art on the side, um, part of the Captain America Wave. And then on the back here, we have the Wave. We only need White Vision and Scarlet Witch. So let's look at the back of this really quick. The weird cut was because I completely forgot to read the little profile that says Baron Zemo, the Sokovian Special Forces officer who targeted the Avengers, has been rotting in a German prison, but recent events will reignite him with a ferocity. Does that really fit the show? Kinda not really. So we'll hopefully get those figures soon just to check it out. And then in the box, obviously, he has his normal face, not masked face on. So let's get him out of the box and check him out on that end. All right, and here we have the Baron Zemo figure out of the package. Let's do a 360 of his luxurious look. He's got his pointer finger out. He's got a weird, non-realistic looking pistol, uh, which odd choice for a live action show um, and his regular head also, also if you pull this back he's got a purple jacket now let's measure him up and do some articulation tests so he comes in at six and a quarter inch which is pretty good for a Marvel Legends figure. <clears throat> he his balance is okay. He's got the they have not perfected the fancy shoes yet or um forgot what they're called. Slack shoes, I guess, or something like that. But I will say, look at this face. This is a really good David Girl or Daniel Girl, whatever it was, face. Um, and let's look at the accessories really quick. Um, we will switch into these in a moment, but we got, like I said, the weird pistol that's not realistic. His Zemo head. Two more hands. And a, your the book, which obviously you can have him hold here as well. But, uh, yeah, so one thing that we got to check is that we can have the dancing Zemo move. So at least that's part of it. We do have to switch the handout for the other one. We'll get that in a second. But let's do articulation. So head can go 360 up and down. Arms can go out and around. The, um elbow can fold all the way up hand can go around and up and down he can bend from that way although that leaves the rubber of the jacket flying up also can rotate him 360 degrees here same with his thighs and his knees can fold as well as his feet being able to move. So let's go ahead and switch him out for you guys to see what it looks like. And there we go. So let's see with his fist if he can pump. Yep, good. <laughs> so we can get Dancing Zemo. The head, honestly, I think I like his uh, non masked head better. But the mask on him does still look good, but it honestly just makes him look like a bandit. Doesn't really make him look as imposing. Uh, maybe it's just because I'm a big fan of Civil War and everything. But we should also talk about the piece that he comes with, which here it is right here. This is his wing piece uh, for Sam. We only got two more to go, being Vision and Scarlet Witch. So yeah, let's do just a quick comparison 
with the other two Falcon and Winter Soldier characters that he really interacts with. We could put John on there too. He's just actually behind um, the camera instead of next to it. So putting him next to everybody, it, it's a good fit. This is the Captain America and the Winter Soldier, or er, Falcon and the Winter Soldier um, figures. And they just look amazing together. This wave by far is amazing. I mean, we might as well get Loki in on this just to show off everybody. Um, but, I mean, look at this wave. It's just beautiful. It's a great wave. I love it. Um, I have to say, though, that th even though this figure is not included, this wave really does lack in the accessories department. But Zemo himself has enough accessories to kind of make up for at least one other figure. So let's say for John. Um, so let's rank him out of everybody. Uh, since we have five fi figures, he is honestly just pushed up to the first best just due to the accessories. Beat everybody else out. Um, and just a very good looking figure. Even the mask is growing on me now, honestly. It looks great. Um, and let's rank him out of 10. There's really not much to complain about. So I am giving him a 10 out of 10. Definitely a great A figure. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are enjoying these new type of reviews. Make sure you leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. And follow me on all my social media down below. It's that nerd Ryan telling you guys, have a marvelous day.